Yo, what's going on guys? We're back with another Angel 21 breakdown video with the new Halloween event. Look at all of these cars, man. We've got, oh man, we got six master cars right now in the game. We got a bunch of other Halloween character cars, man. I'm looking at some things. I see Steven Stamkos, I see Hayes, Kane, Fox, Chara, Gibson. We're going to be breaking down all of these cars, or mainly the big ones. Um, obviously, we have these six master cars. We have Cassian, um, we have Cassian, Tara Vinen, Carlson, uh, I, I'm trying to see that third one is. I, I can't really see that properly. I think that's a European player, if, if I'm not mistaken. But we have six of them. They're here for one week only. So, you know what? This is sick, man. This is sick. Plus, we have a little small pack opening as well. So, obviously, uh, let's go check out the, the new sets they have. Or let's just break down the cards. Um, so, let's just check the new sets they have. I think they, they're in the game here. So, again, seven days for this new event. It's a banger event. So you trade in, um, you get a choice of one or two Halloween player items. You trade in two gold collectibles for this. Um, then you trade in gold. You trade in eight gold collectibles for a choice of one of six eighty nine overall. Uh, ha, um, all six of them, you get to choose which one you want. I can't lie, this event did leak about ten minutes ago, and I checked out John Carlson, and he's probably the best defenseman in the game. So. Um, I honestly think it might be worth it um, to honestly get that John Carlson. Obviously, if you want the tradable version of it, you trade in two extra gold collectibles. You get a tradable version of that card. But that John Carlson is probably going to be going for a lot, man. He has two of the best synergies in the game. I mean, like, this event is just crazy. Um, you can choose Marcel Nubil. I'm not even going to pronounce his name because I know damn well I'm trying to get flamed. But 90 overall elite master. So we have, we have him. Uh, you trade in... I'll show you guys what you guys trade in. So again, you trade in a jersey, the Burzlin jersey, and then obviously nine gold collectibles. You get the mash one, untradeable. Same thing here. You trade in, uh, you get a 90 overall Zach Cassian. Trade in 80 Cassian and the Oilers jersey for, uh, and plus nine other collectibles. Uh, same thing here, Tara Vine. And all of these are the same. John Carlson, Pareko, uh, Yelmar, all of these guys. All of these guys. This, this event is probably my, the best event in the game. So those are all of the... Uh, let me check if I missed anything. But those are all these sets. Again, same sets as uh, the first event in the game. Nothing really different um, in these sets. But the thing is, so I'll show you guys the packs before we go into the breakdown of the cards. Um, so here are the packs. Um, I don't know why the packs are glitched right now. But obviously, there's these cards just look so good, man. Um, and let's just go check out these cards. Let's go break down these cards in depth, man. Um, this this is definitely probably my favorite event. I mean, it's the second event in the game, so obviously it's my favorite. But obviously, we'll check out the goaltender first. Um, so here it is. He's got 89 overall master card. Synergies aren't too bad. I mean, again, goalies are weird. I'm not going to go too in-depth um, in the goalies. I definitely am a pretty big fan of the fan art. I'm not going to cap with you. I like the fan art. But that is the 89 of the 90 overall versions of the card. Um, next up, we got Tara Vinen. I expect Terravine's card to be honestly really good. So we're going 89 overall Terravine and the Wizard. He's got Magician and Swarm, 89 Speed, uh, 91 XL, 894 Agility, 89 Balance, 6 Shooting Stats. I mean, definitely. Um, I'm going to make a vi separate video on talking about these cards even more in depth. But obviously, this Terravine is definitely going to be a nice card to have on your team. I have his base card, his 82 overall base card. I've, I've been using it for a while. I'm a big fan of it. Um, we also have a 86 overall Patrick Kane here. Um, he's got Magician, 86 Speed. Uh, Patrick Kane, I haven't really tried out his card this year. Um, just, I feel like he's a card that I feel is kind of hit or miss. I feel like his speed is not the best. 86 Speed is just above average. But other than that, it's a really sick card. His Magician, um, that's the 86 overall Kane that we have in the game. Um, next up, we have the Edmonton Oilers, Zach Cassian, who, again, beast of a card. He's got Gladiator and Spark. Honestly, it's not a bad card. I mean, I thought the Zach Cassian would be pretty worse. 85 speed, obviously, yikes. Um, it, it's 85 speed isn't, you know, realistically the best um, the best speed. But still, I mean, the shooting stats are really good. Overall, he's got really good phys physical stats. This is a really good card. I feel like all these cards are honestly really good. Um, I feel like last event we had a couple bad cards. Um, I'm trying. I'm trying to remember who who what's the other card again. There's also a Marion Hosa, I think, as well. If I'm not mistaken, let's see. Again, you guys are probably like again 81 Marion Hosa. Not gonna go too in depth on him, on the uh, 
the Marion uh the Marion host up. We have Colton Pareko. I'm I'm forgetting I'm forgetting one. I, I don't forget one, but here it is 89 overall Pareko again. Beast of a card, 6'6, 84 speed again. Not the best speed. Shooting stats are amazing. He's got he's 6'6, shoots right, workhorse and balanced as his synergy points, which those are you know the best synergies you can honestly have uh for this guy. Again, here is his uh master 90 overall play. Again, same card. Beast of a card is this um, you know, this Pareko. But man, uh, let me show you guys the Mitch Marner as well. I think there is a the Mitch Marner, but man, uh, this this team is lit. So here it is, the 86 overall Mitch Marner, Halloween Mitch Marner. Here it is. Um, those are his stats. Got 87 speed, pretty pretty good. I mean, it's pretty good stats on him. I ain't finna cap with you. He's got really good stats on him. Um, just overall, I feel like he's a really good card. To, you know, to have on your team, um, amazing card to have. 87 speed, pretty good for an 86. But again. Um, I also forgot to show you guys Steven Stamkos, his 86 overall card, where is it? Here it is, 86 overall Steven Stamkos, Howitzer. This is going to be a really good card to have. Uh, another good Halloween 86 overall card that's going to probably hold a uh, value, at least for a couple weeks. Um, but man, let's, this John Carlson easily, in my opinion, is the best card, the best defenseman card in the game. We had Merrill Hiskinen last week. He is got the two best synergies distributor and howitzer the two best synergies in the game he has them that is crazy this like look at the stats 85 speed th this is without the synergies okay 6 3 85 speed 9 2 endurance speed category goes crazy uh slap shot actually all those stats go crazy now let's activate howitzer 88 speed let's activate distributor 91 speed and look at all everything else goes up this is easily the best defenseman in the game it's crazy because I, I definitely feel like this card is worth it. If, if make your gold collectibles, this card, in my opinion, is a 100% worth it. Um, I think, honestly, you go with the tradable version. It's going to cost you two extra collectibles. But I say screw it. Go with the tradable version because I feel like this card is going to have a lot of value. Um, especially if you bought gold collectibles for pretty cheap. Um, here's his master version. Again, he gets 90. Again, same card. I mean, this, this, this is amazing, man. These cards are fantastic easily in my opinion um the the best uh in my opinion he's the best card in the game easily like it's, it's not even it's not even close now who is i'm, I'm forgetting someone I'm, I'm trying to say wait it's the european league okay i'm where is this guy is he is he in the swedish league i don't know what that team is berlin let me see this shit real quick um man you guys are probably laughing at me i don't i don't know my european leagues that well man i'm, I'm not finna cap with you it should be right here right Damn, I suck ass. What the hell is this shit? So, the Dell League, right? It's got to be in here. It's got to be in here. I'm not that. Yeah, here it is. All right, so we're going to be looking at this card right here. Um, I'm not even going to pronounce his name, but let's see his stats. Not a bad card. He's got howitzer. It gets 88 speed again. Not a bad card. 89 overall. I like this. I like how they added some European cards, man. I, I fuck with this shit, bro. I really do. <sighs> That's some really good stats on that card. So, that is um, most of the guys. I know I didn't break down all of them. And it's because I want to do a separate video on all of them. So there's still like, I think, um, I broke down all of them, most of all of them, if, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I did. So I, I broke down all of them. Obviously, for these ones, uh, there's some I didn't break down. Like, I didn't break down Adam Fox and everything else. Gibson is probably going to be pretty good. But, you know, I didn't, just, you guys know the gist of it. So obviously, um, they've also added some new challenges. So you can guarantee get the Marion Hosa. Um, so here you can guarantee get the um, the Marion Hosa, and you can get your collectibles, and you get the Marion Hosa and the Henrik Zanderberg uh, 81 overalls. So if you're a fan of them, you can pick those up. Um, I'm gonna quickly just back out because I feel like um, I'm missing some parts of the set. So I'll be right. Back. All right, like I said, these hut challenges they're gonna be going crazy. I don't. The hut challenges are not currently in the game, which is weird. But you guys know what I'm saying. Get the collectibles. Obviously, we broke down the sets now. I'm hoping that they've released the packs um, they have. So, he, again, here are the packs now. Uh, you get a untradeable Halloween character starter pack. So, this pack, 65,000 coins, 1,300 points. You get a guaranteed gold uh, collectible and a guaranteed Halloween player item. Um, here is um, the pack odds for this for this one. Again, same packs. Realistically, all these are the same packs. Halloween Goblin pack, 180-plus overall player. I'll show you guys the odds. Again, the odds are... I don't even know why it's not showing the odds. Man. My game's bugging right now. But again, here are the odds for the Masked Man pack. I mean, odds, I'm going to be honest with you, the odds are not the best. These are the three Halloween packs. The rest of the packs, we still have the Mega pack, the Players pack. But those are... This is the entire event, man. Now, let's go... I got some packs to open up from Squad uh, from squad Battles. 
um these are the packs i have um let's open up these packs man hopefully we can get something good but then i'm gonna call it a video and i want you guys to tell me guys what you guys think about this event in the comment section because i'm gonna be real with you i definitely think i'm a big fan of this event i mean this event in my opinion um i like the cards i definitely think that john carlson is a card everyone should be going for just that card's a beast um we got a ryan studio here not a bad pull but unfortunately he's not going to be going on my team um he just isn't going on my team just there's no reason for me to even have him on my team um you know but we got the shit the dog the dog the dog shit packs out of the way now we got the premium packs i don't expect myself to pull anything um i would like to but again i don't ex expect myself to pull something uh really good um if i'm being real with you like i don't really expect myself we got kevin hayes that sucks because kevin hayes has his halloween card out so i mean that definitely sucks but again I don't expect myself to pull anything out of these packs, man. But just doing this for the content, maybe, maybe we pull like an 89 Carlson. Like, imagine if that happens, bro. Speak that into existence. Can we see the 81 Thornton? Not, I'll take the gold to trade in for a gold collector. I'll definitely take that. Uh, Nick Schmaltz, no, definitely not good. Ryan O'Reilly is not a bad pull, but unfortunately. Alex Goligoski, you get a primetime Alex Goligoski. Uh, okay, I mean, he's a decent card. Get a primetime. Um, and... Ryan O'Reilly, uh, who else we get in this pack? Not a bad, it's not a bad pack. I mean, obviously, Ryan O'Reilly's probably not going to be worth a lot. I mean, he does have 90 face-offs, so uh, not a bad pack. Obviously, the final pack we have of the video is the Mega Pack. 30 items, 4 guaranteed 80 pluses. Please, EA, come on, give me a good pull. Give me a good pull. Um, yeah, this is not cutting it, man. Uh, Mars is so, I don't really want that. Come on, man. EA, stop snagging me right now. We're getting a bunch of golds, which is perfect for me because you know damn well I'm be trading in that to get a gold collectible for these players. John Gillies. Uh, man, what the hell? Come on, man. So we get uh, Anthony Duclair. Man, that's a dog shit. Pull, bro. But I told you guys when I mean it, man. People don't believe me, but I, I really feel like I have the worst pack luck in the community. Like, I always see these kids pulling some sick stuff. I feel like I definitely have the worst pack luck in the community brian elliott and jake allen to end it off man but that's the packs man tell me guys what you guys think about this video if you do drop a like subscribe let's go with this